Hey everyone, it's Will, Gamer Dad, with another video for you. So in this video, we're going to see the third and final character quest for Radius. Now, if you haven't already, make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. Also, I do have a Patreon account for those who want to support me this way. So if you caught the first two character quests, you'll know that the uh, Crimson Blade that she possesses is actually uh, from the Beast King Gilna in her parallel time layers. And so, unfortunately, this is a fire-based blade that actually is um, only meant to be used by beasts, being that it's actually got infused with the power of Salamander, the fire elemental. Humans were never meant to um, possess it or use it. And so if you've watched uh, either through the um, complete side quest chapters 1 to 3, as well as her personal quest, you'll know that each time she uses it, it damages her. Now bear in mind that if you do use Radius for real, uh, she does have moves that actually self-damage her every time and all her fire moves essentially damage her in some way, shape or form. Now luckily in terms of her skill set, she does have a self-heal as well, uh, which I will be going over uh, you know, when I get a chance to. Anyways, uh, we are going to search far and wide to find a solution to the problem, being that every time it damages her, not only does it damage her, it's almost like a permanent drain on her life force. And I will say the relationship between Aldo and Radius is certainly not one where they're actually being shipped together. This is one of the few uh, female-male relationships between these two uh, where I feel they're really more of a deep friendship rather than, you know, she's crushing on him or he's just oblivious to her, like, you know, uh, being interested in him. So I actually really um, enjoy that and it's a lot more refreshing than all the girls chasing Aldo, the uh, main character. Anyways, um, as they explore all over, um, you know, there come some tribulations and, you know, near the end of the story, I won't spoil it for you, of course, um, you know, uh, almost some worrying areas as well. But hopefully the end of the quest uh, reveals uh, something very different. And I will say I will look forward to Radius when she ever she has her manifest weapon. So that's my only hint for you. Anyways, like most storyline videos, I'm going to stop talking now and let you watch the rest of the video in peace. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.
加減はしないからな。この命、愛と燃え尽きようと。次もこの調子で行こう。